what's up everyone welcome back to another video from long island and i'm here at bit Pass, long island as you can see it's a gorgeous halloween trail it's called jackal lantern blaze they had two location basically one is in hudson valley and this one is old bed page so it's really an amazing experience during halloween almost 7000 hand carved uh, pumpkin and pumpkin uh, structure will be here so i hope you'll enjoy it it's a definitely a family friendly place they had a parking as well free for all and the ticket will cost you somewhere like uh, 40 dollar for per person oh my gosh look at that so many kids enjoying it <laughs> taking pictures look at all this skeleton <laughs> made from pumpkins basically this is one of my favorite uh, place to basically visit during uh, Halloween So let's uh, continue follow the trail. It's a bit dark here, but I hope uh, you will be able to see all of these gorgeous vibes. Oh my gosh, look at that. What is it? Oh my God. Seems like a fire or something like that. Look at that. And here is a fire truck. Wow. Look at that. Oh my goodness. So cool. There are so many people right here. Like most of them are family with small kids. And this trail approximately uh, 45 minutes long. I just love that. Here is a police car and ambulance also. This is a huge spider web and they even detail in these uh, trees as well. Oh my god. Nassau County, County Ambulance. Nassau County Ambulance right here. Look at this. This is awesome. So far, uh, it does seem like uh, the same as last year, but I'll definitely let you know if I see something new or different this year. 
and they had this uh, candle right here to lead that up it's a bit uh, nice as well and it's a very secure place very very secure place right here sleepy hollow county basically from 50 miles now we are entering into sleepy hollow as you can see right here it's called sleepy hollow this part is uh, one of my uh, favorite basically it's saturday that's why it's uh, way too crowded oh my goodness it's definitely an amazing uh Halloween trail As I said that here you will find almost 7,000 hand carved pumpkin and they are right here throughout uh, this trail 7,000 Oh my god Every year it became my one of the must go place um, for Halloween outside of New York City. Like uh, from Queens where I live, it's somewhere 26 miles. So it's not that far, it took me like 30 minutes. The music and everything gives your vibes. Uh... It's very tough to find the ticket, uh, especially in weekends. In weekends, this place is so busy and it's fun. It's fun to explore this with people. Here. Bit weird. Dome stick clock. And this is the history behind that clock. And here it is.
Oh my gosh, look at that. There are so many small kids are visiting the, this place as well. And this small details right here, like this candle, it's a real candle basically. It even feels much more realistic. And this witch right here changing the windows, look at that. Oh no, oh my gosh, did you see that? Oh my god. So, so weird. This is Hewlett House, haunted Hewlett House. Let's see what it's all about. This is so awesome. Look at this. Look at this detail in the tree. These are all real pumpkins. This is new this year. Last year, I didn't see this uh, trail right here. I didn't see those last year. Yeah, they got something new. Windmill. Look at this windmill right here. This is what it's all about. Now we are following this trail. Ooh, it really seems a bit haunted. Like this is really an amazing place.
Oh, look at those. It seems like some sort of flies. I hope it's not lantern flies. Now, I think we are heading toward Sunflower Field. Oh no, right here, this house. This is Amityville Horror. There are small history about it. You can pause and you can read. Here is a P. Oh my god. This is literally awesome. This house. Oh yeah, she does? That's cool. Sunflower Trail is also one of my favorite. It's even more uh, attractive. Like the good thing about this. Uh, Halloween trail here, Jack o' Lantern Glaze, is basically uh, they had small uh, story behind every attraction right here. Which is the best part here. And I highly, highly recommend if you've ever been in New York City and want to do visit this uh, place or if you are living in New York City and never visit this uh, Jack o' Lantern place I highly highly recommend seems like a beehive right here this is also new this year it was not here last year you hear the realistic music and here is every New Yorker proud because of Statue of Liberty. There she is, Lady Liberty. And small history about that. And when you are watching this video, I already uploaded a video in my channel. I did visit it, the crown of Statue of Liberty a few weeks ago. So I would link in my video description box. You should watch that as well. Look at that. The Lady Liberty. And here are some American flag color. Red, white and blue. And this pumpkin tunnel is one of the best, like, one of the best uh, show in the house. See, lots of kids are here enjoying this uh, Halloween theme right here. Okay. 
Here is a pumpkin unicorn. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is the best thing. Look at that. Look at above my head. You see? So amazing. See? So packed crowded. Long Island Hall of Fame. Right here. Ooh, look at that. Something coming out. I guess uh, that's a, a dinosaur or something like that. We had to check that out. Seems like it's a cat. What is it? Let me know in the comments. Now we are going inside the Long Island uh, Hall of Fame. Dr. J, right here. Uh, here is some information about Dr. J. Basically, a pro basketball player from NBA. Right here. And here is Sue Bird, another basketball player from Soyset, New York. Small information about her. Here is Maria Carey, a singer, songwriter, and a producer from Greenland, New York. And here is Perry Lupone from Northport, New York, singer and actress. I think there is a few more right here. John Jett, singer and a producer from Long Beach, New York right here and also here we got Billy uh, Joe singer and a songwriter from Hicksville New York it's right here this is absolutely amazing and all of these are real pumpkin real pumpkin here is D Snyder singer and songwriter from Baldwin New York look at that even the hair it's also very realistic very very much yeah, it seems like a, some sort of old farmhouse it does it does uh, old farmhouse right here and here are also some jodic sign right there let's see the information here 
and feel free to let me know in the comments what is your zodiac sign did you see your one feel free to let me know in the comments Here is mine, Libra, because my birthday is October 6th. This is Scorpio. Also, pretty cool edition right here. But again, this is all hand carved pumpkin. Oh my god, look at this lighthouse. Oh my god. This lighthouse here is so amazing. Pumpkin lighthouse. It's saying that Long Island is home to some 25 lighthouse. Wow. <laughs> oh, look at that. This is also very, very Oh, yes. I will wait for uh, the smoke. I don't know when the smoke will be come out. Look at this uh, minion, pumpkin minions. It's coming out right now. Oh my gosh. Look at that. It's so epic. Like, it seems like he's doing some sort of uh, smoke. See, all of these real pumpkin hand carved. I think uh, I'm not too exactly sure why pumpkin become a Halloween uh, stuff. But it seems like it makes more sense that pumpkin is a type of fruits or vegetables that stay a long time. So if you decorate your home or you carve a pumpkin, there is a slightly higher chance that it would be stay longer period. Because pumpkin uh, really stay a long time. And this is a Tarshi Bloss. Look at that. Some interesting facts. You can pause and read. And this is also new this year. I didn't see them uh, last year. And here is basically Bones Beast. It reminds me of Jones Beast. Just a creation of uh, Jones Beast saying Bones Beast. You see that? Bones Beach. Pretty awesome. 
John become bones. Oh, I did see that carousel. I didn't recall to see those carousel previous years. Sarkas train right here. It was here in last year as well. That it really feels so amazing. Like, especially if you came with your families. But I think the price is a bit expensive. $40, sometimes it's $48. Depending on what time you're coming. So, I wish if this price is like a little bit less, like $20, $25 more people i think willing to come here because 40 to 50 dollar for these it does seems like a bit overpriced to me it's really a great place like to spend some time but i don't think it's worth like 40 to 50 dollar it doesn't worth 40 50 dollar 20 to 25 dollar is fine but I think since they are providing free parking, that's why they charge more. Because most of the place, if the ticket price is less, they charge for parking or either you will not have any facilities for parking. So, look at that pumpkin carousel. So in that sense, it might be okay a bit. pumpkin place but I will wish that in upcoming days they will lower the price a bit it's just my uh, personal opinion some of you guys may be fine with this 40 to 50 dollar let me know what do you think about that do you think that after seeing this place it's worth $50 seems like it's a corn maze I was trying to come here a bit early like uh, 6 or 6 30 right before the sunset but all the ticket was sold out and I got this on 8.30 slot. But that's it. It's a nice trail. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's not that scary, but a great place to just spend some time and give the Halloween spread. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button. And if you're new to my channel, please consider subscribe to my channel as well for regular updates and video like that from overall new york and holidays are coming so i will post so many videos in holiday season so make sure you press that bell button so you'll not miss any notification from me or my channel and feel free to check out my paypal or patreon page because Pat patreon is basically an amazing opportunity to support this channel financially so I could afford this kind of uh, place so I can show you virtually what's going on and you can enjoy those from your home from your own comfort so I would be really appreciative if you check out my uh, patreon page and become a patreon member so once again thank you so much everyone I really appreciate each and every one of you for joining and giving me the opportunity every single day to show something different from New York City. Let me show you the parking. The parking is pretty huge, like it will fit almost uh, everyone. Like I think that's why they charge a bit extra. So. As you can see, this is basically the entrance towards my uh, right, and we are exiting now. And in the entrance, we got some pumpkin car as well. And 
and I think now 9, 9 p.m. a lot of people are coming in. But the thing I really observed about this uh, jack-o'-lantern that most people are coming with their kids like kids are really loving this place like it's not too scary and that's a good thing about that that thank you you too thank you sir and they had a restroom right here as well this is the restroom Last chance before exit. All the restroom right here. Oh, she's like, he's a wanderer. He's a wanderer. That's one word for it. This is the parking. They are divided into several sections. And it's pretty secure. It's one of the secure uh, trail I've ever seen, to be honest. So in that sense, I think it's a great place to at least take a shot during the Halloween time. So thank you so much, guys. I will see you soon. Bye-bye.